It's actually a relief because I've been wanting to get this for a while because I work with small children. And topping the news, teachers now are able to get the coronavirus vaccine here in Wisconsin. A whole new wave of Wisconsinites now eligible to receive the COVID-19 vaccine beginning today. This is part of phase 1B. That's right. Starting today, people in phase 1B can begin to receive the vaccine. And that list includes educators and child care workers, people enrolled in long-term Medicaid programs, some public-facing essential workers, like those, for example, in food supply chains and 911 operators, non-frontline essential health care personnel, also residents and staff of congregate living settings. And while everyone can sign up for their shots, the state is urging vaccinators to put those in education at the front of the line. Madeline Anderson joining us live at the Wisconsin Center with more on the effort to get those teachers vaccinated in the walk. Yeah, that's right. The vaccine is now available here at the Wisconsin Center for anyone in K through 12 or early childhood education and to either work or live in Milwaukee. School staff across the state are rolling up their sleeves Monday to get their first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. We needed to bring our, um, our state ID and um, an employee ID. Milwaukee Public School special education teacher Christian Islas was among the first group to receive his shot at the Wisconsin Center. I think it's really important that um, as the leaders, as the role models at the building, uh, we need to First, be healthy and well. Like most MPS staff, Islas hasn't seen his second and third grade students since last March when instruction switched to virtual. Even they've asked me, you know, we hope to see you soon in person, you know, before the end of the school year. The Milwaukee Health Department's medical director says the city is receiving approximately 9,000 doses of the Pfizer vaccine this week, specifically for educators. Our main focus for the first half of March is on vaccination of the education sector and then we will be focusing more heavily uh, on the rest of the eligible phase 1B group. An estimated 25,000 individuals qualify, including daycare workers like Christy Kessler. She's remained in the classroom and is relieved to no longer have to only rely on masks and hand washing to stay safe. I've been wanting to get this for a while because I work with small children and honestly, if I caught it and was asymptomatic and passed it on to one of my kids at the daycare, I would feel terrible. So I'm glad I finally got the shot. Now, meanwhile, people in previously eligible groups like those 65 and older can still come to the Wisconsin Center to receive the vaccine. MPS is also partnering with the health department to vaccinate staff on March 9th and 10th at North Division and March 11th and 12th at South Division. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Madeline Anderson, Fox 6 News. All right, Madeline, thank you for that.